In this video, we will demonstrate how to generate a list of MPG pages. For better understanding, we will do this using the example of generating a clickable list of all states in a country or cities in a state. Navigate to your desired project and click on the short code tab at the beginning of the page. Select the desired header from the drop-down list. The short code for the selected header is displayed under the header which can easily be copied. Under the Generate List section, we can add various filters. In this instance, on selecting the MPG City Condition, a list of cities are populated in the drop-down to the right of the equal sign. Based on the conditions selected from the source file, respective options are populated in the adjacent space. Any number of conditions can be added by selecting the green plus icon on the right. Any additional condition may also be removed by selecting the red minus icon next to it. In this section, we can choose how we'd like our data to be displayed. The direction allows us to sort the columns in an ascending, descending, or random order. Ascending and descending orders require us to choose a column from the data source to order by. We can also set up the limit of rows that the short code will display here. When the Unique Rows option is set to Yes, all duplicate rows are not displayed. Additional shortcodes can be added in the Select Shortcode section by selecting the shortcode from the drop-down list. The Shortcode Sandbox displays the shortcode generated based on the above selected parameters. On clicking the Preview button, the URLs are displayed. The Copy button copies the shortcode to the clipboard that can be pasted on any page not generated by MPG to build up in-links for generated pages. Additionally, this shortcode supports attribute-based URLs. For example, if the body of a shortcode contains a link, but if the base URL isn't specified, it returns a 404 error when the shortcode is pasted to the generated page, like in this example. When you specify the base URL in the body, the link is accessible on the generated page. So, the link is absolute and not relative. Essentially, the URL is generated through a combination of base URL and the href value. And that's it for this video. Like and subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon to receive useful tips in the future. If you have any question, leave a comment below or contact our support team.